this was very scary i got a recently an email i write one of my subscriber and he said to me that promote sir i had a fight with my manager what to do i have lost my job i want to know about how to handle the fight with manager how could I have handled this scenario because he took a revenge by taking my job uh, right now second question was not getting an enough call how to basically handle this right and third part is i am a manual tester with 3 years of experience how i can basically learn and start my journey towards the automation so let's target these three things and first of all the elephant in the room is fight with manager what you don't have to do all right let's get started see the person has basically lost a job because he was fighting with the manager i'll tell you what is the scenario fighting basically means there are certain things as a manager because i am also working as a manager right i have almost like 20 25 people around me and they are assigned to me right i am responsible for their salary career growth and many things but again the most important thing you have to understand that what exactly your managers want from you managers actually want from you that you don't basically first of all bug them right this is important i am telling the truth very important you don't basically have to ask lot of question from the manager you should be self reliant or you can say self uh, you can do the most of the task by uh, basically discussion by the other team right and they can help you to basically provide you proper estimates or blocker but again what exactly you do in reverse is that whatever the task is assigned to you you generally are not able to deliver then your manager will come in and he will try to understand that why you are not able to do it automation is the need of the hour this is a wake up call for the manual testers if you want to convert to automation job ready automation tester batch is now live four months live batch saturday sunday we are going to learn about core java api automation web automation link is in the description do check it out all the projects are live will the 24/7 doubt sessions on sd.club check out the more details see the problem can be because in this case i can clearly understand the person didn't have the what we call knowledge related to the project he was assigned that's important because see as a manager if i have hired you into my project right you should know about the project you understand it very well you document it properly right suppose it was a manual testing project so i need that you should create a proper test plan test cases bug report send them daily bi weekly if required send the daily communication right see managers are not directly will become your enemy until and unless they will think that there are two important things you basically are not delivering what exactly is expected from you or second important point is that you are basically a stubborn and you don't want to change whatever the manager is telling you you are not doing the things and you are stubborn right that's the only way they will fight with you that's what i have seen in this case right so don't do these things but this is the most important thing first of all what you need to do is that the immediately whenever you think that your manager is not happy right what you need to do is add a sync up into their calendar immediately and ask them questions right uh, like for example hey manager what exactly you are expecting from me what exactly i was not able to deliver and how i can basically improve these three questions that you should add or ask immediately to your manager right even if you are doing good what i would suggest you is ask that okay uh, hi manager how i can improve more the more you will ask this question right he will say that okay yes this person basically is responsible right second important point which i have noticed in the email that he has sent is the visibility problem guys visibility problem problem you can solve by basically emailing him daily reporting him you know what i still do it even if my manager never asked the updates right i send him over a dm over slack or teams that okay this is the task that we have done as a team because i am a manager i have to give as a team right so this is a task that we have done let me know if you want if you have any concern or anything right visibility you have to increase and let them know what exactly you are working on see another important point which i have noticed that if there is a what we call issues with your manager right uh, what i have done is that you can ask to the upper management or upper management your hr also if somehow they can change your reporting that is very important thing because i have seen many people doing it where they generally don't have a good relationship with their manager you can change your reporting also that is also allowed in this case right so the conclusion overall which i want you don't have to fight with your manager please don't fight with them what you need to do is that increase your visibility let them know what you are working on this is the super important thing if you are not able to deliver them right let them know also that okay for example you know what i was working on a ticket my manager was expecting that okay i will do a uh, 10 tickets right and then i told him that no i can only do seven this is what i expect in this case right after negotiation we agree that okay seven you will do it and three will think about it then i deliver eight and he was very happy so that's how you need to manage politely you have to convince him that okay i have only this buffer time and this is task that i will do and don't argue with them right again see i don't argue with them politely you can say that okay this is you have to showcase showing is always important than telling right i know there are many people 
people who are like this for example i know there are reporters of me who directly say whenever i say that okay guys we have to do 10 tickets and he will say no i will not do 10 i will do 3 only then i will ask him okay 3 if you are doing right tell me from 9 to 5 what exactly are the tasks that you are doing how many meetings you have then the more i dig as a manager then i got to know that they are just completely becoming a stubborn and they are not just following my command in this case so i will generally ask them properly and then we negotiate and we come up with 7 or 8 or whatever the task it is that's how i generally manage but don't fight with them that is not the correct way in this case okay the second important question was not getting the calls right now guys calls will increase for the qa definitely i think it will be uh, better in soon enough right and manual to automation i think we have covered manual to automation guys four month plan for job ready automation tester is there or also i have shared it publicly also topic sheet is there keep following that and do projects and add it to your resume definitely you will get a job as a automation tester right thanks for watching i hope this video helps so don't do fight with managers and this is how you can resolve the conflicts also by smartly proactiveness visibility and basically tell him the more asking the right question and make sure you have one to ones regularly with your manager that is the most important things right i'll see you in the next video bye bye perfect